Hello, everyone. We're here with David. And David, I'm going to ask you to pronounce your surname because I'm not even going to attempt it. And David <laughs> works with the uh, Microsoft Java team. David, introduce yourself. Uh, yeah, so my name is David Grieve. Uh, and like Rory says, I work at Microsoft. I'm part of the job engineering team at Microsoft. And, um, where we do all sorts of JVM engineering. Uh, we also do a lot of performance tuning and uh, 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 Java perf um, profiling, I guess you could call it, uh, garbage collection analysis, things like that. Try to make your workloads uh, faster, better, more performant. Now, everyone I've met in that role has such a fascinating history. Tell me about your career up to date. Um, that, uh, and, and, and it has to have involved at some point Oracle or, or Sun Microsystems or anything like that, because I've always noticed everyone in profiling has always come through the, that kind of channel. Sure. Um, so to, to, let me just put a little context on that. There's the, the, when you talk about this, there's really kind of, two different kinds of engineers. There's a, an engineer that looks at things from the bottom up, you know, from the JVM uh, on up. And there's other engineers that look at things from the top down, like I'm an application and, you know, I want to perform better. And I, I'm more of the top down kind of guy. I don't know a whole lot about uh, Hotspot and C2 and all that kind of uh, stuff that they do down there. It's just amazing to me. Um, but I, I started in Java, geez, back in 1.2 days. so you know, 1998, 99, somewhere in that time frame, I started working on Java. Um, I worked uh, for a little, after some time, I worked for a little cell phone company uh, down in Massachusetts called Savage, which you may have heard of. Um, and then from there, uh, after that folded, I went to work for Sun Microsystems. Uh, I was part of the Java engineering team at Sun Microsystems. Um, and worked on JavaFX at, at Sun Microsystems. Of course, Oracle came along, bought out Sun Microsystems. I continued in that role at, at uh, Oracle for a bit. Um, by the time I left Oracle, I was working on Internet of Things and client libraries for Internet of Things. So I've done a, a lot of different things in Java, um, just, you know, just a lot of different things. Uh, so I'm a, I'm Java... <laughs> JavaFX is, is now one of the cool kids. And I say that because yeah. recently it was built into the Visual Studio code, um, the uh, the wizards of that. And there was a lot of support uh, given for uh, Visual Studio code. So tell us a little bit about JavaFX, uh, where Microsoft uh, involves themselves, your involvement with that, and also possibly also um, what you're currently doing at Microsoft. So I wish I could answer better, you know, what Microsoft's interest in JavaFX is. I, I don't know that right now. And in fact, I was just talking to my manager this morning, and that's one of the things I'm going to go try to figure out. Because um, I do want to uh, be part of the JavaFX community. There's some issues that I left behind <laughs> that I'd like to go and, <laughs> and address. Um, uh, you know, what I did uh, for JavaFX is I did the CSS implementation of JavaFX, and um, that seems to get a lot of bad press uh, when it comes to JavaFX performance. But um, yeah, so so what I what I'm doing really at Microsoft right now, I, I'm part of the, the tooling team. Um, so I work with you know people like Kirk Pepperdine, uh, working on uh, GC log analysis. Um, uh, you know, we, we've got uh, uh, an open source GC toolkit, uh, which does a lot of GC log parsing and can take a GC log and create, uh, break it down into the discrete uh, GC events that, that, that are uh, in, the, in the log. So you can do analysis on that. Um, and I've always, yeah. you know, I've been a cloud engineer for the last 10, 10 years. And for me, GC just means money. Because the minute that you optimize your GC, you can actually get milliseconds back on your uh, your performance. You can increase uh, your um, well. You can decrease your your memory footprint, so you can actually save on uh, serverless compute, on app service compute, on your your container compute. 
Um, so yeah, this is really, really yeah. great that Microsoft is investing in that because it means from, from me as a customer, it affects everything really that I do. Absolutely, and, and not only you as a customer, um, but you know the, the, the organization that's serving you up, right? So if I can, if I can get uh, you know smaller heat faster and and all that, I'm, I'm saving money on my end. Uh, I still charge you the same, so I'm making more money uh, with a smaller footprint, like I said. Um, yeah, so that's that's one of the things that, that we definitely look into in, in our team, uh, you know, work with um, the organizations within Microsoft uh, to, uh, at this point in time to, to tune uh, workloads. Yeah. Now, the irony is that Java 17 um, and 18 has just been, well, 18 has been released and we're yeah. heading towards uh, really great support uh, on Java 17, uh, you know, across a lot of the Microsoft services. And one of those key features of um, Java, the, the new garbage collection is no garbage collection. Um, you know, uh, I, can't, I can't pronounce it. I think Shenanaban or Shenano, Shenano. <laughs> they're, they're Shenandoah. That yeah, yeah, that, that one, that Shenandoah, Shen 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 <laughs> yeah. There's Shenandoah and there's ZGC. Or ZGC, as I pronounce it here in the states, um, you know, they're kind of two competing um, modern garbage collectors. Work very well for very large heaps, um, and the they're they're aiming for uh, zero pause time. So you know, you're you're down into singles of millisecond uh, pause times these days with with those uh, garbage collectors. It's pretty amazing. Um, yeah, no, I, I need to, I need to, I need to uh, test that often because one of the things that we we have is that we've just rolled out is container apps, um, and container apps are these serverless containers that you can just bring up uh, and bring down, and it's a great yeah. opportunity to actually have a uh, pauseless uh, garbage collector because it means that your container only lives for a few microseconds, and then you just bring it down. Right. So, so there is, so there is a, a no garbage collector, garbage collector. Uh, that, no, that's yes, that, yes, yes. Yeah, and maybe that's the one you're you're thinking of. Yes. I can't think off the top of my head what the, the correct term for it is, but it's 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 really a a uh, there's no garbage collection at all. Um, so for, for the kind of service that you're talking about, this comes up, comes down. Um, yeah, no no garbage collection overhead at all. Yeah. You know, this is really exciting. Um, uh, David, tell me a little bit about uh, what you would like to uh, give the call to action and what you uh, excited about coming up uh, with with Microsoft and uh, your role. I think I think some of the exciting things that are happening now is, is a lot of uh, organizations are moving from Java 8 to Java 11, at least at this point in time. Hopefully, you know, we'll somewhere down the road we'll get to 17, but so much is stuck in the Java 8 land and there's so much uh, that you can do now with Java 11 um, that it really does make sense to, to move to, to Java 11. Um, I, so we're I've trying to spoken help. to some customers and they're going from eight all the way through to like 17. It's it's such Absolutely. an, and then, yeah, it's it's like they, they, they forgot 11 completely and there's so many nice features of 11. Um, so yeah, so it, it's it's an ex exciting time, but it's so fast paced. I just can't keep yes. up with it. You know, eighteen was released uh, the other day, and I still don't even know all of the features of that. So uh, thank you so much, David, uh, yeah. for coming on and and discussing with us. Um, and uh, we look forward to some really great uh, new tooling and enhancements uh, with the the Java engineering team. Thanks so much, We're and. We'll, we'll, we'll put the links through to some of those uh, services that we mentioned there. And uh, as always, uh, it's great to speak to you. Thanks, David. Cheers. Thanks, Roy. Bye.